What's up guys, welcome back to Prime Growth Investment, this is your boy Ali and if you are new to this channel be sure to subscribe and leave a like at the end of the video if you've enjoyed it. So today I am back with a SPAC, a SPAC that has potential of giving you profit and in uh, today's video it will be Holicity and Holicity is a SPAC with the ticker symbol of HOL and the price of it is $13.95. For those of you that don't know what a SPAC is or what a SPAC company is, uh, a SPAC company sole purpose is to raise money in order to bring a private company uh, making it public. And they chose Astra. Holicity chose to merge with Astra and making Astra become public. So if you go to Astra, which is a space company, uh, you will see that it says right here Astra is going to go public. And this is through the combination of businesses with Holicity. So for those of you that don't know, um, space exploration is a big deal right now. You know, NASA, SpaceX, they have so many plans. You know, they want to send rovers, they want to send rockets, they want to send satellites uh, all over the space. So it is a huge potential stock. And Astra is going to be the, uh, the first space company to go public. So this is what I wanted to show you guys. And definitely do your own research and do your due diligence before investing with this company. But I have high hopes for this uh, merge in my opinion and I will tell you why. So Helicity is a blank check company that is bringing Astra public through a reverse merger. And just like SpaceX and Blue Origin, a bigger companies uh, that does, um, they're trying to bring the new era of space exploration. Astra and its peers, uh, they want to make spa uh, space more accessible. And how are they doing that? They're doing it by improving technology and reducing the cost. So uh, what they're actually doing is this. They are going to go ahead and focus on building a much smaller rockets. And they're going to produce it in a much higher volume. And on top of that, they're going to launch it from a larger numbers of locations around Earth. So unlike big companies where they're, they're, they spend billions of dollars on building one huge rocket, this company is going to go ahead and focus on frequency. They're going to focus on building a small rocket that is, that is being launched in uh, more frequently and in more different locations. And they believe that doing this will um, help... Um, improve the communication on earth it's going to help protect planet by collecting data and such and it's going to go ahead and help uh the new generation of services to enhance our lives um this is why i believe it's uh i have high hopes for this because this company is doing something that many other companies don't do and what they're trying to do is launch more uh, uh rockets and as uh, just like how NASA is doing, which as I mentioned, the space exploration is a big deal right now. And they, you know, NASA, SpaceX, they want companies, uh, technology. And this is why I believe Astra is going to be a key factor in terms of technology. So NASA, they just actually landed a Perseverance rover on Mars. And it went and it landed in Jezero's uh, crater. And the Jezero's crater was actually on Lake on Mars about 3.5 billion years ago. And what they're trying to find is ancient life like microfossils. So in order, um, what this company is actually doing, which is Astra, is going to, um, with Holicity, Holicity is raising money. And once it merges, Astra is going to be the first Pub, uh, publicly traded space launch company. It will be the first uh, publicly traded space launch company, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, in, in, if you guys know about ARK Invest, uh, it does have an ETF, which is an exchange traded fund. Um, this one is called ARK X, and its sole purpose to focus on uh, space uh, companies. And many people believe that. Uh, 
uh, Kathy Wood would be a big investor with Holicity, and they want it. Uh, they want Holicity to ride the arc fueled wave. So, guys, I want you to guys to do your own research, do your due diligence, and focus or have this company is uh, under your radar. See what is going. Uh, at what point this company was actually, um, it was actually uh, over twenty dollars, but right now it's dropped down to thirteen dollars uh, ninety five cents. Just like all the other stocks, like 90% 90, 90 of the stocks uh, dropped down in the past uh, two or three weeks. Um, so be sure to have this company under your radar. Do your own research and see whether you want to invest in this company or not. As for me, I am going to go ho hold a little bit on this company until I hear a little more news about it or hear big investors uh, uh, dealing with this company. Let me know what you think of this company. Leave a like and subscribe for more videos.